Hi Pradeep, welcome. Hi Vedi. I have two very straight but basic questions. How is Airtel reimagining its cloud portfolio? Okay, great question. To answer that, let's first talk about what our enterprise customers are telling us about their needs and pain points. Their first demand today is that their computing needs are very different from what they were earlier. They were computing at the cloud, at a public cloud, but they are now doing at public cloud, private cloud, and at the edge. That change is driven because of two reasons. One is data consumption has changed and it as work from home, et cetera, come into play. The second uh, change is because of IoT. IoT is producing data in factories, in location, which need to be analyzed and processed at the same point. With data also comes the whole problem of data residency. Where do we keep this data and how do we process it? That's a big push from the government and from enterprises around security of that data. So taking this in mind, we then went back and looked at our strengths. Our strengths are the fact that we have Nextra as a subsidiary under which we have 120 edge data centers and about 11 large uh, data centers. Our strength is our network, both fixed and, and wireless with 5G that will allow more consumption to happen, enterprises to connect to them. And if we put all these together, the offering came out naturally, which is we offer hybrid cloud to our customers with our partnerships with public cloud providers, the hyperscalers like AWS, GCP, uh, Azure. We can take an enterprise customer to the public cloud. We also run India's largest private cloud. So if the customer has a need for a private cloud, we can build and operate for them. And also we've just launched our edge cloud in partnership with IPM, which allows them to compute and store data and run use cases right at the edge. So in simple terms, our edge strategy is hybrid and at edge is the strength that we bring to the table. That sounds awesome, that Thank sounds you. really great. Okay, I heard two keywords. I heard 5G and I heard consumption. So my next question to you is, what does data consumption look like with 5G onboarding? Fantastic. So um, as I've talked about the enterprise customer, there's an impact on our end consumers also. You know, today people, are using more and more data on their mobile devices, you know, with the OTT players becoming more popular, consumption of media on devices is only increasing. But as we use more data, we are congesting our networks. Obviously, 5G will provide that bigger bandwidth, which again will drive higher consumption of data. The challenge that media companies face is how do you make sure that this media is consumed at the edge or on device without any buffering, so to say, for our consumers. And that's where again Airtel comes into play with our 5G network and we have launched our own content delivery network, a CDN uh, part, uh, uh, offering, which allows consumers to experience media in a much better manner and e-commerce companies and media companies to deliver that content to them in a much better manner. So consumption will only grow, but we are here to help with it. That sounds great. I'm looking forward to it. Thank, Thank you so you. much.